Hey, what's up everyone? Sol here, and welcome to my run of the Divine Diablos Lufinia, uh, the Lufinia that dropped with the newest summon grind. And I wanted to bring Shangaroth here because Ramses' burst effect is so crazy that I kind of want to showcase it off with Sephiroth and see what we can do here. Should have some funny numbers. I'm also going to be doing a showcase of both Machina and Ramza. Uh, both of them have their LD Extend and are both fully built aside from not having Ramses' burst. Didn't get it, and that's A-OK. -okay. But we are going to have the support burst uh, popping that off. We're bringing Odin as the summon. Let's do this. Alright, and before the fight starts, I just need to say, it is hilarious to see Sephiroth running. Like, he's just one of the guys. He's always depicted as, like, flying around or teleporting. And here, he's just, he's just getting a jog with everyone else. I can respect it. But okay, with um, this stage, and this event rather, uh, Machina and Ramza both received their LD Extends. Machina, it, it does a lot for the guy, because in two HP dumps, he now inflicts the, uh, the debuff after his first HP dump, which allows him to do his follow-up. Most importantly, however, um, he gets brave before every single follow-up now. The potency on his follow-up is not very good. And so having a way for him to kind of counteract a little bit with Brave Gain definitely helps. Now, in future Lufinias, that's not going to be as effective because future stages will cut Brave Gains. Uh, but for right now, it is quite good, for sure. Okay, I'm going to shout one more time. Now, I'm not using Ram's LD because I need to use it periodically through the fight at certain intervals. Otherwise, um, things get bad very, very quickly. So the first interval we're looking for is a 79%, and I don't, I shouldn't get him beneath that point before he does the recast. If he does the recast before he hits that 79%, I'm good, I can survive it. If he does the recast um, after that 79% and he gets his power up, that's bad. So the orb here is actually pretty easy to corral, just use a move that applies 6 buffs to the party. And the orb will go up by a massive 15 turns. Pretty crazy. Especially compared with some of the recent Nefenias that we've had. Where it's it's just stupid. It like goes up by one or two turns. And it's just a real kick. Real kick to the teeth. So it's nice having an orb that's not only you know easy to increase. Um, but you know, there's, there's definitely options to do it. Like for example off the top of my head. Beatrix. Ramza. Selfie. Well, those characters can definitely make the orb go up. And there's even more options than that that I'm just not remembering. Alright, so, one turn before recast, he will always use Gravija. <clears throat> which reduces everyone's brave to one. There we go. Galvanize just to make sure no one gets broken here. And hopefully it hits everyone. I need it to at least bare minimum hit Machina and Sephiroth. Okay, good. Got that nice Odin blessing going. So for two turns after his recast, you see those orbs floating next to him. These are important because he does increased HP damage uh, to the party while those are active. And they only go away after he takes two turns. Okay, here we go. So here's what I was talking about. Here's this dark energy stance. And you need to do yourself, you need to do a 200,000 damage launch in order to make this stance go away and for him to be susceptible to debuffs again. And also for him to not gank you with his color dark plus move. Sephiroth's already getting a 59,000 Brave Regen. Oof. That was glorious. Okay, 
beautiful. All right, now Diablos has one more trigger where he will enter that dark energy stance. And off the top of my head, I cannot remember what that trigger number is. So I'm, I'm going to wait until he does that. We can do one final launch with Ramza and get our debuffs reapplied. And then we're just going to go to town. I'll just like one real. Get stuff all healed up. There we go. Okay, here we go. She's back in this dark energy stance. Ultimate here with this Ramza. This is going to be giving us all the auras. And I think, I think it's a good time to burst. Now, keep in mind, this is with Ramza's auras going, this damage that Sephiroth is doing. That's how just sad and depressing this man is. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, so he's getting 113,000 Brave Regen right now. Oh yeah, we're getting all the launch damage.
give him more time, and then I can galvanize with my rams and make the orb go up. Go. Okay, I think we're going to summon. <clears throat> this is a good time to do it. Ever has a great opportunity here to do a ton of damage. Sephiroth is getting 139,000 Brave Regen right now. Just, just wacky, just wacky numbers. I wish I could steal. I wish I could steal one more turn. <coughs> Slide up, take advantage of that burst effect. EX ought to been glorious. I'm wondering if Fervent Blow is actually going to do more than Black Material. Probably not, because I don't have the burst effect massaging my damage anymore. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay. I guess I would have done a little bit more. Not much, but a little bit. Dark power's their limit. <laughs> what is the game talking about? He's at 2% HP. Uh, just call it a hunch, but I think he's going down here. Okay, and I think that's a wrap. Boom, down he goes. So there we go, guys. Yeah, so... For this stage, you definitely want to have um, launch on demand, if possible. Cloud's call can work in a pinch, as can Ramza's call, if you're not right, running Ramza, for some reason. Um, and yeah, just you just want to have nice memes. You just want to have a nice steady diet of battery to really help you know get that over that 200,000 launch amount. So there we go. There's my comps. I've, this is the first time I've seen this screen, and oh my god, there's a lot going on here. So... Um, Yes, look at the screen, and there, there we go. That's who I used and how I used them. So thank you guys for watching. Appreciate it as always. Take care, everyone. I'll see you guys again here very soon. Good luck on the grind, and stay safe. See you later.